Hi, I'm Chris Ryan, uh, one of the teaching professionals here at the Belfry, and I just want to share with you a few tips uh, on the short game and, and chipping and where your focus should lie. So when we're on the practice area, okay, as we are here now, um, if you work in any technical changes, maybe you're trying to work on your setup or the tempo or the backswing or that kind of thing, then your focus should be the area that you're standing in. So I would stand here and my focus would be on what I'm trying to do with the club, Am I trying to keep it this side of my hands? Am I trying to set a bit of a wrist hinge? Whatever I'm trying to do, that's my focus. And what I want to try and do is set up a station where I can practice that, okay? Now, the difference with the golf course is when we go onto the golf course, our focus wants to be more out here, okay? So actually what we're trying to do. Now, as you can see, I've set out a landing zone there, okay? Which is where I want that ball to land, okay? Now, that area has to now take up the majority of my focus, okay? So when I go through my routine, I'm only going to look at the ball for a short period of time. What I'm going to do is I'm going to look at my target, the landing zone, for a much longer period of time. Now what we tend to see golfers do on the golf course is they get over the golf ball and their practice swings are such as this and their focus is very much down here. So they're trying to get their technical model correct. Okay? That's for the practice area. Okay? So if I was to go through my routine, I would start here, looking at my landing zone, and as I walk in, I'm still looking at my target, okay? Set myself up, and I'm gonna have some practice swings, still looking at that target, okay? So at this stage, I've probably looked at the golf ball for a, a millisecond, okay? I haven't really looked at it for too long. What I then do is walk in, set myself up, again, look at my target, back at the ball, and hit the shot, okay? So my focus is more on what I'm actually trying to do. What am I trying to do with the golf ball? Where is it trying to go? What's the break? Where am I trying to land it? In practice, yes, your focus will be a lot more on actually the technical change that we're trying to make or the, the improvements we're trying to make or the setup changes, okay? So what we want you to try and do is really understand the difference between what you're trying to do when you practice and what you're trying to do on the golf course. If you practice correctly, when you go on the golf course and you just focus on target, then the, uh, the actual action itself should replicate what it did in the practice area. So if we can understand the difference, that's going to give us much better practice and it's going to give us much better results on the course. Thank you.